pretty, um, I thought I'd talk a little bit about my sister today. Um, you know, I, I, I don't take her for granted, but I sort of woke up this morning and I was, and I realised how lucky I am to have Luce. She's, you know, she's, she's a strong kid. Um, you know, I, I remember, um, I remember sort of after mum and dad died and she, she moved in with the grandparents and she, she started copping a lot of flack from some kids at school about living with your grandparents. How, you know, how stupid is that? And this one time when I was, I was dropping her off, they were on the street and I started yelling out and I... I stepped in because I just got so angry straight away. But the thing that she doesn't realise is, you know, I, I I didn't need to. I didn't need to. She's you know, she's got a she's got a tough skin on her. Sometimes I think maybe it's unfortunate that she has to have that, but she's a strong girl. She you know, she wants to I think she's a veterinarian they call it. You know, vet. She wants to be one, you know, that's... How good's that? How good is that? I couldn't imagine doing that. I guess another memory comes to mind when... When we all went on a holiday, mum and dad were still around and... We, we sort of had, had this little picnic stop at this, at this farm and... She... We get out and I, I sort of go over because there's horses, these horses, beautiful horses come up to the fence. And, you know, Luce just goes up and just, without any bar, just touches them, you know, across the fence. And, yeah, I, you know, I could never imagine, imagine just doing that so naturally. So she's, she's got a thing, you know, she's got a thing. And she's, you know, through all this, all this crap this last year, you know, she... And she's still doing well at school and yeah that's that's she inspires me that's that's what I'm getting at and yeah um I'm very proud of her